Let's talk permanent journals. Before journals, after journals. Now let's go back and recap quickly. We've talked a lot this chapter about the transient journal where each amp has a camera on it so anytime a row is going to be changed on its disk it takes a before picture for rollback purposes. It's called transient journal because it never keeps it permanently. If the transaction is successful, it throws the picture away. If there's anything that goes awry, it just replaces the before image, says there's an error, and everything's back to normal. It's for database integrity. Permanent journals are different than that. Let's talk about before and after journals. What happens is, is if you create a table and say, I want a before journal, or you say, I want an after journal, or you say you want both, what it's going to do, if there's any insert, update, delete, the AMP's going to take the before picture for the before journal. It's going to take an after picture for the after journal. And that's going to be stored out there permanently. After a day, you'll probably take all of those journals and back them up to the mainframe to save space. But you're saving this on purpose in case something goes wrong and you either have to roll things back to the way they were at a certain point in time or you've backed up the system with a full system backup and you need to take the after journal and recreate those transactions so that you've lost nothing. A before or after journal is going to take a before or after picture and the idea is to store it permanently so you can restore and roll back or roll forward. I know what you're saying. Hey Tom, that last explanation got a little heavy. Back off Jack. Let's take it a little easier. Here you can see that we're going to talk about the differences between the transient journal and the permanent journal. Each amp has their own camera to take a before picture for their transient journal so they can roll a transaction back. It is transient because they will never keep that picture permanently. Now, the permanent journal is the opposite. Every time you say, I want a before picture for a before journal, it takes a before picture. If you say, I want an after journal, it takes an after picture after the row has been updated and it's going to use that to store temporarily on Teradata and then permanently on tape or a backup system so that again they can bring that data back in. The transient journal is just a temporary picture for the life of the transaction. A permanent journal is going to last permanently. This lesson is brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Serving the data warehousing needs of the world for 20 years. Check out coughingdw.com for more information.